What is going on guys? Today, I'm gonna to be showing you three products that you can take photos of next for your next product photography you at home. Either you're in studio, or either just something to take photos of. So number one is obviously what's coming up right now, because we're in, we're actually a one day away from December. So Christmas, any type of Christmas products, anything to do with like stockings, any sort of like lights, like light, like Christmas lights, obviously. And uh, like these little lights, that, like these little um, globes that like you can turn on and off and they shine light or either they have the glitters going through and uh, they're always good to buy and for you, especially when you're going through Christmas, a Christmas period. And also a lot of Santa, um, a lot of Santas as well. Obviously he's like the main thing, so. Um, and obviously Christmas trees with lighting is good as well. So anything like that, you can just take photos of and you don't really, you don't really need to use any lighting besides probably like one small light so then it's actually, you know, popping. Like the pop, the, the photo's popping, you know. And uh, you know. And uh, number two is necklaces or watches. So anything like this or either. Yeah, like that. Anything like anything shiny, anything metal. Usually watches and necklaces do usually come into products and it just depends on what you're also gonna be using. So for one of my product photography, I was actually using a metal box and also a, um, oh yeah, there's another Christmas thing in the background and over there. <laughs> uh, that's, what, that's what I was just trying, that's why I was looking over there because I was like totally trying to explain. Anyways, um, and with necklaces and watches, they're always good to take photos of, especially if the watches are actually really expensive, which I don't have. I've only, I've only got like this and my Fitbit. Um, which is in my other hand. Um, yeah, just either using using them and making sure the color grading and the metal is not like shining too much and don't use don't use too much light. Otherwise, it just it's just it's just like the sun just beaming off and you're getting it. You're gonna get a lot of um, lights bouncing around everywhere, uh, everywhere. Because and also it depends on the room as well. And um, and where you're also shooting as well. So there's that too. Because in the product, in, whenever I do product photography, I usually do use my kitchen. It's not a great place, but my room is pretty stuffy and small. And my room and my kitchen is probably the best place to go. <laughs> um, and the first, so using your own photo, like print, prints of your own photos. So actually, when I went to the city the other day, I came up to this. Uh, this um this little store that was in the middle and uh i got this so there you go it's called memory block that's the guys have on like canvases right there as well either have canvases as well Canvases are usually pretty good. Um, I don't know how much they are, but like they're pretty good to use if you're going to display like from real estate, or either you just want to take photos of your own, of like display them, however you want. To, if you're if you have a shop or a business or something, which is always good to display your own photos because because you're not going to use any mail any anybody anybody else's photos. So um, yeah, I feel I feel like I feel like. Putting your own photos out there for your own business is always good. Or if you want to use someone else's footage, you can always go on a website and use someone else's footage with their permission, of course. Um, so that'll be it for the video. I hope that helped you. And uh, I also posted another video like about six six days ago or a week ago. Uh, please check that out as well. And also check out my Instagram. I've just posted a new reel yesterday as well of um, me going to me going to the towards the city. And it's my first time actually doing uh, editing in a reel. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, please check that out as well. And also like and subscribe as well for more content like this. And I'll see you in the next one.